All new at six, relief for a Kansas City area family. That's how the mom says she feels after a judge just sentenced the man who kidnapped her at age 12, held her captive for nearly 20 years. 41 Action News investigator Kat Reed has what happened today in court. Today, a federal judge in Oklahoma sentenced Henri Piet to two life sentences. After weeks of emotional testimony last June, a jury found him guilty of kidnapping and travel with intent to engage in a sexual act with a juvenile. It wasn't until after Rosalind McGinnis escaped that she revealed the true horror of her ordeal. Rosalind McGinnis lived in Springfield, Missouri, when her stepfather, Henri Piet, first raped her just days short of her 10th birthday. The kind of trauma that I've been through, it's like life stopped the moment that you're abused. Piet moved the family often. Then in Oklahoma, he arranged to take McGinnis from middle school when she was 12. Her family didn't see her again. And the next thing I know is that my mother's not there, my brothers are not there, None of my family's there, and I'm by myself with this man. Piet moved McGinnis to Mexico. They sometimes lived in tents or shacks with dirt floors. Piet beat her badly. I have about 21 scars on top of my head, and I'm not talking like little ones. I'm talking about ones like that from being beat over the head. He raped her often. She had her first baby when she was 15, nine children in all. 19 years later and still in Mexico, one night while Piet was passed out, she gathered the kids and went to the nearest American consulate. Eventually, the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children and others helped get her back to the U.S. and to relatives in Kansas City. Rosalind is one of our heroes. I mean, you know, when she escaped that captivity in Mexico, she wasn't only concerned for herself, she was concerned for her children. A year after after her escape, authorities arrested Piet. And today, McGinnis told us she felt relief after hearing the news. After the sentencing, Oklahoma authorities took Piet into custody to face state charges of molestation, child abuse, and rape of a child in Wagner County. Cat Reed, 41 Action News. The McGinnis family is now living in a home in Kansas City that was fixed up for them by volunteers and businesses within the KC community. They're also receiving support from the Jace Foundation, founded by J.C. Dugard, who was kidnapped at age 11 from a bus stop in California. The family is doing well and moving forward with their lives.